Juan Connemara is the lead, early leader from Don Polly, and then West Tor, followed by it has to be Dark Marler, and up on the outside, Toodle Horse, and they're jumping the first fence now. Towards the back end of the field, you'll find, you'll find things change in company with Eagle Lion, and Game as a Pheasant is the back marker. That's the early running order in this, the British Racecourse Bookmakers Association Men's Open Race. Going out towards fence number two, it's Juan Connemara, John Dawson making it by about three lengths to West Tor, who's sitting along the outside of Don Polly, who's in the black jacket. It has to be as well up there, going over that fence, and there it has to be, has gone. It has to be as unseated the rider. So we're uh, heading now towards the top end of the course, and it's Juan Connemara in front by a length and a half, being followed now by Eagle Lion, and uh, then up along the outside is West Tor and Toodle Horse. Tom Polly's just lost a place or two. Game is a pheasant and Dark Marler are following, and things change as the back mark, and it's Eagle Lion, who is now in front with the loose horse, right in front of the field, going now to the open ditch. Eagle Lion will take off in front and really stood off the ditch. So going behind the buildings, the pace being made by Eagle Lion and Aaron Anderson with one Connemara now dropping to second West Tor and Toodle Horse third and fourth respectively as they reappear. They're chased by Don Polly, Games of Pheasant, Dark Marlin, Things Change is watching on. Down the side of the track, Eagle Lion cuts out the early word. Going now towards this next jumping test, leading by one and a half length to one Connemara and West Tor. On the approach to it, Toodle Horse and Don Polly track the leaders. Then Dark Marler, who is held up on the outside of Game as a Pheasant, and the back marker is Things Change. So, running up the hill to the turn in, three fences to jump on this section of the race course, and as they approach the turn into the straight, Eagle Line loses the lead, and loses the lead very quickly as they approach the turn in. One Connemara is back in front, and the one Connemara taken on for the lead on the outside by West Tor. And now they turn into the straight, facing up to this next plane fence. One Connemara, West Tor, one and two. Something amiss with the Eagle Line. Eagle Line has been pulled up before getting to that fence. So they're all over the first in uh, the straight, with the exception of Eagle Lion, who's called it again. Going now towards the second one. And it's one Connemara, West Tor, Don Polly, and Toodle Horse, and the pink colours just in behind. And then Dark Marler came as a pheasant in the yellow jacket, held up to the inside, and things changed out wide, but they're very well grouped as things change now, passes one or two horses. So this is the last fence this time round. And it's one Connemara joined. And he, in fact, headed there by West Tor and Toodle Horse. But back on the flat, one Connemara's alongside again. So it's one Connemara, West Tor, Toodle Horse, Don Polly. They've been followed by Things Change, Dark Marler, and the game is a pheasant. And they've got another circuit to go. They've jumped eight of the 16 fences thus far. Going to the turn, it's one Connemara and West Tor along the outside. Don Polly, the former Cheltenham winner, just in behind them. And then a Toodle Horse, Things Change, Dark Marler, and game is a pheasant. So starting their run to the first fence on the second circuit, Juan Connemara and West Tor disputed from Don Polly and a Toodle Horse. They're chased to this next fence by Dark Marler, things change and game as a pheasant. But they're well bunched as they jump in and only about five lengths or so first to last. So heading towards the next and it is Juan Connemara and West Tor. A gap that of a length and out of Don Polly with Toodle Horse for company. Things change, Dark Marler, those two held up, followed by Game as a Pheasant, and they're going on up the hill to the 10th fence, which is a plain one. West Tor now attempting to move on from one Connemara, Don Polly, uh, he's racing in a prominent position with Toodle Horse, the outside, good jump there from Don Polly, saw Don Polly moving to second. Going out towards the top of the hill, they've got six to jump. Uh, it's West Tor in front by a length and a half to Don Polly. One Connemara just being squeezed along there. Followed by Dark Marler who's getting into the shake-up. This is the first on the far side. It is West Tor now taken on for the lead by Don Polly. A length and a half away in third place is Dark Marler as one Connemara is joined by Things 
change, or pass by things change. Toodle Horse has lost ground, gave us a pheasant just struggling to keep up. They jumped the open ditch, and it was Westall and Don Polly who touched down together there. They've got a bit of a run now for four out from behind the buildings. Westall and Don Polly by a length and a half to Dark Marler, who's up along the inside of things change. Then one Connemara, two little horse, the one detached by a few lengths is gave us a pheasant making the run to four out and as they do so it's west tour and don polly just in behind those two are both dark marler and things change making the approach now to the fourth last fence only two legs covering the front four as they jump it they're being followed over it by uh, on the outside uh, in the the pink jacket the pushed along tr uh, toodle horse and one connemara game as a pheasant so now running up the hill and don polly has got the lead Dark Marler has moved into second, things changed third, uh, one who dropped out very quickly was West Tor, so turning in with three fences left to jump, it is Don Polly at the top of the straight from Dark Marler, uh, there followed by things changed, further back to one Connemara, two horse game as a pheasant, this is the third last, it's Don Polly and Dark Marler, they're the front two, but they're split by about three or four lengths, Don Polly being asked to win the race now, going towards the second last, extended three to five lengths. Dark Marler second. Game as a Fenton and Toodle Horse have both pulled up. Two from home. Don Polly is over it with a good lead. In second place, Dark Marler can make no impression. One Connemara's third. Things change has been pulled up. Only three going. Here's the final fence. And Don Polly soars over the final fence and is now on the run in with a clear advantage over Dark Marler and one Connemara. But it's Don Polly and Fiston Burrell. And Don Polly will win on the point to point scene. A former Cheltenham hero, Don Polly, is the winner. Second place is Dark Marler and third and last, one Connemara.